What's going on guys? Mike with Iceberg Gaming with your World of Warcraft Gold Farming Guide video for today. As you guys know, the Legion Time Walking event with the Mage Tower is ongoing. And if you've been following my channel, you know that I've been making an absolute killing on the Dreadful Gladiator's Crafted Gear. So much so that I've actually run out of Ghost Iron Ore. Uh, normally I get all the Ghost Iron Ore I need from my Tiller's Farm setup. Check out my videos on that up on the channel if you have not, if you are not familiar with that. Um, but I've used so much Ghost Iron Ore that I'm out of it. So I was doing, uh, trying to figure out a good Ghost Iron Ore farm for you guys, but I think I found something better. So stay tuned to the end of the video, and I am going to show you what I discovered. As I said, since I'm hunting for Ghost Iron Ore, I am on Pandaria in the Dread Wastes. I'll go over the route at the end of the video. But if you are looking for a Ghost Iron Ore specifically, I actually recommend the Valley of Four Winds instead of the Dreadways. As you can see from my map, there's quite a bit more Ghost Iron Ore. The reason that I thought this farm would be good is because I expected to get a lot of Trillium. Uh, sadly, that has not been the case. But fortunately, the price of Caperite... Kype Parite crystals is actually very good so we are getting some good money off of that i believe that the price of the caperite is kyperite kyperite someone correct me in the chat uh I, the, I believe the reason for the price being so high on that is because it is used for the crafters mark number four and our number five and uh people are cranking those out like crazy right now because of the crafted gladiators gear 20 minutes into this farm, we have a loot appraiser looted item value of about 10.7k gold, which gives us a roughly 30 to 33,000 gold per hour result. This is the route that I've been using in red. I've basically been follow the, following the corrupted area of the map to pick up the caperite and quite a few Pandaria herbs as well and grabbing the ghost iron I was looking for along the way, too. For other ways to take advantage of the Legion time walking event, as well as many other gold-making opportunities, make sure you are subscribed to my channel. Thank you so much.